to create track mat transitions we are going to use three steps first one creating a shape animation in after effects and then render the video and finally place the video in premiere pro first of all open after effects in the after effects select new composition here I'm going to the weight 1922 1080 and the frame rate is 29.95. The duration is around 4 to 5 seconds. I'm creating 5 seconds. Click OK. Now go to the rectangle tool here. Just click and hold. In here, I'm going to select start tool. Now I'm going to fill solid white color. Color doesn't matter. And give the stroke value to 0. We don't need stroke. Here now I am going to create a star. Press and hold shift key to make it a perfect star. After creating the star, go to the align. Just align it horizontally and vertically to the composition. After creating shape layer, go to the polyester one and expand transform polyester one. Now we are going to create a keyframes per scale animation. First of all, select this stopwatch to create a keyframe and change this value to 0. Move the cursor to the 15 frames and change this value to 100. Now moving to the few more frames in here, change the scale value to 120 and move forward to few frames and the change back to 80. This will create a pop up effect like this and move the cursor to the two seconds mark and fill this shape layer entire composition like increasing this size now the animation looks like this select all keyframes and press f9 to ease them and change the graph value by clicking here and change just smooth changes like this now go to the polyester one and expand stroke one and give the stroke color give any color that doesn't matter change the opacity to 50 percent and create a keyframe for stroke width here I am going to click here to create a keyframe. Now select the shape layer and press U to bring all keyframes. Now I am going to move my cursor where my star is going to 100% and I am going to change the stroke width to around 50. Now I am going to move my cursor to the few more frames and here I am going to change the stroke width back to 0. And again I am going to move forward and here I am going to change the stroke width value to around 50 again. Select all keyframes and press F9 to easy ease. The final animation looks like this. Now we done shape animation we are going to render it as a video. I am going to press Ctrl plus M to go to the render queue and in the render queue I'm going to click on this output mode lossless and in the output mode I'm going to drop down this format and select quick time and I'm going to click OK and in the output tool there's the name of my composition I'm going to click on here now I'm going to give a name that is star transition click save click on render this will render my transition now we need to move to Premiere Pro in Premiere Pro, these are my two videos. I'm going to apply a transition between them. Now in the project panel, I'm going to import my rendered video into the Premiere Pro. Select right click on here and click on import. This is my rendered star transition video. Now we need to do a small change. First of all, we are going to place our first video to the second layer and second video to the first layer and move it to the around first video like this and place our transition video on third layer like this now we see 
there is no transition here. We need to apply an attract matte effect to see the transition here. Now go to the effects. In the effects, search for track matte. Apply these to the second layer video. Now we need to change the some settings in the effect control. Go to the effect control and in the track matte, select the matte none to video 3 and change the composite using matte alpha to matte luma and tick this reverse one. Now you can see the transition. And you can see there is a white area in this because our video 3 is extended comparing to the video 2. Now we need to change this expansion to same as video 2. Now this is the final output. Now in this way, in this method, we can create any shape animation and make it as a track mat transition in your videos.